to introduce you to the first female Diné Chief of Gallup for the Police Department, Ms. Erin Tolino Pablo. And there it is, a historic ceremony in the heart of Gallup this morning. The city swearing in their first ever female police chief. After months of acting as top brass, it's finally official. Brianna Wilson shares why she became an officer in the first place and how her community is really behind her. I will faithfully, I will faithfully, and impartially discharge, impartially discharge the duties of my office, the duties of my office, to the best of my ability, to the best of my ability. Congratulations. Just like that, Erin Totalina Pablo officially became Gallup's police chief, a first for the city and our state. Not only is Chief Pablo, as you've heard, the first female chief of police for the city of Gallup, but based on our research <laughs> that we did, she's the first female Diné municipal police chief in the state of New Mexico. Well, when you leading the police force here in the city of Gallup, you're going to be the trendsetter for all uh, the woman warriors that are going to come forward to one day be police chiefs as well. When you were younger, is this kind of what you envisioned for yourself? Uh, yeah, as a female, um, my dad did not want me to do this. But as the survivor of a crime when she was younger, Chief Pablo says she felt compelled to make the same impact in people's lives that law enforcement officers had on hers. So at 21, she joined the Gallup Police Department. Erin has experience in all capacities at the Gallup Police Department, from police officer, first class, sergeant of internal affairs, lieutenant, captain, and now chief. You'll never know if you don't try and um, and look at where I'm at. 23 years later, Chief Pablo is also the mother of six children who look up to her. And similar to the way she supports her own family, she says her biggest priority in this new role is to better support her staff. Recruiting and really keeping um, the officers that we do have. Um, and I think the way that we do that is showing them that we care and, and you know, getting them a wellness program helping them to be able to deal with all the trauma that they in, they endure through their careers here. We'll follow as she makes those changes. Brianna Wilson, KOB4.